Around 300 medical students from the National University of Singapore have been taught how to communicate effectively with persons with disabilities. Now, the module currently covers audio, visual and mobility impairments, but it could soon be expanded to include intellectual disabilities as well. Launched last July, the curriculum was co-designed by doctors from the National University Polyclinics and PWDs. The third-year medical students are taught how to approach PWDs with sensitivity and empathy by role-playing with a patient educator who has a disability. For instance, using writing or lip reading to communicate to a patient with hearing loss. And feedback from students has been positive. We're thinking maybe of expanding to um, other areas of disability, um, possibly intellectual disability, under discussion at this point of time. According to the Social and Family Development Ministry, more than one in ten people here who are 50 years and above have some form of visual, hearing or mobility disability. And with primary care doctors fulfilling most of the community's health needs, PWDs say this course could help to increase awareness of the issues that they face and improve doctor-patient communication. For me, I have encountered um, doctors, um, even you know, nurses, healthcare professionals that um, are not aware of my hearing. And sometimes, um, because I'm also in the healthcare field, sometimes when I work with them, they would just they get angry, they get um, annoyed that I don't respond.